well. All right. Thank, thank you. you bye bye. Bye. All right. He's so that been was a, nice. a real good friend. Yeah. For for the whole year we've known him, he just happened to be uh, driving around looking for a place to eat on Thanksgiving because um, he shares uh, custody. Joint custody with, with his, his daughter. daughter. So and his we're like mother was with the daughter. So five minutes alone. until we're out of time. Out of town. Out, out of time. time. Oh, okay. Then I can eat more olives and the cheeses or the turkey. I know Is what I'm getting you ready? for a Christmas present. What, Chef? Hearing aid. Oh no! <laughs> How could I wear these lovely earrings then? Well, I'm going to get you some glasses so you can well, hear me. You know me. what? You could get ear hearing aids in earrings, and then I would. Yeah, but it. I thought I'd get you some nice glasses so you could hear me. That would be fine. Come on, now have, that's an old joke. I would joke. just have one more thing in common with my great hero. Who's that? As you know who it is. Who is it? You know who it is. Who? The man with the cochlear implant. Oh, Rush Limbaugh. Talks, talks on the golden EIB. Yeah, but I thought Glenn Beck was, too. Oh, I like them both. Okay. I like a lot of people besides you, Chef Larry. Oh, thank you. <laughs> but these are people, my, my radio yeah. heroes. And Randy Henry's my radio hero. Oh, you mean you fit me in as one of your radio heroes? No, you're Oh, I didn't know I was going that route. <laughs> <laughs> right. You're one of my favorite radio people. Thank you. Otherwise, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, but you're the one with the voice. Sometimes. Yes. And you're going to be doing Swap Shop Monday and Tuesday. Oh, this week. So anybody right. that calls in... Monday and Tuesday, you're going to be on the radio. Yeah, we must that say... That beautiful, uh, lovely voice of yours. We must... Uh, now you're going to allow people to come into the studio. Wish our condolences to the... Um, yes, we wish our condolences married, to Mary. Uh, her her father passed away. Yeah, so she's so. going to New York for his funeral. Right. Uh, that's too bad, especially around the holiday, they have to deal with yeah. that. But, um, yeah, we're going to be doing uh, a week. Yeah. Are you doing the swap shop? I said I'd help you out. No, you know, Mary offered to help me too, Chef Larry. I know, but she knows how to do. I was receiving. Radio, she does a better voice than I do. I was receiving awards for my radio work before the two of you listened to a radio. Well, I wasn't going to do the <laughs> voice. Joking. <laughs> What's that, Chef Larry? No, he didn't listen I, to radio. I when can't he was compete a kid. with her voice. He did not listen to radio when he was a kid, Chef Larry. Television, all the way. Oh, TV. He was a you TV name it, I'll man. tell you all the old shows with Andy TV. Griffith, the whole nine yards. I was a radio person my whole life. I yeah. just loved radio. I I used to... Really? You know, I didn't start listening I to radio? I used to sit with my ear up to the radio. And, I just lived it. And I, I didn't start listening to radio world. until I was like 16, 18 years old, once I had my learner's uh, permit for driving and yeah. then got my car. For, for Chef Larry, radio is... In the car. car. It's all well, about the car. They didn't have TVs in the car back then. No, <laughs> right. now they have TVs in the car, but you know, I still wouldn't do that dry. when I'm driving. He doesn't let anybody else drive right. when he's in the car. He, yeah. So that would be the problem for him. Yeah. We did. You used to watch TV in the RV when we had one. Oh yeah, that's a different yeah. story. But you know. Yeah. But when you're driving a car, yeah, it's hard Some to watch. Of the RVs they turn off. They won't yeah. let the TV work. Right. Here. So you don't crash. But you Jerry rigged it, so it could. Yeah, right. It just got bypassed some certain things, yes, and that's all. Right. You can figure. But again, we want to wish that. everybody a happy Thanksgiving. Yes. Uh, oh, oh, am I? Did I do it politically wrong? Is this supposed to be Happy Holidays? No, it's supposed. to I mean, to be I heard that. somebody say Happy Holidays. I said, well, isn't it Thanksgiving? <laughs> yeah. It's well, Happy Thanksgiving then. <laughs> it's crazy. It, you get so you know what? Nervous. Merry Christmas. Here things. to all our listeners. Happy Thanksgiving, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and what other kind of holidays are out there that I don't know Ramadan. about? Ramadan. Happy all those holidays. Happy all of them. Right. Happy to dog holidays. Yeah, Jack. <laughs> Happy and birthday see, to Jack. And we're going to get we're going to get the Christmas tree with a uh, which actually we call our Hanukkah bush. No, we call it our Christmas. Tree. Well, we call it a Hanukkah bush because it's a Christmas tree with a Jewish star on top. That is absolutely incorrect <laughs> in this house, Chef Larry. I don't. I respect having a Hanukkah you know, tree if that's what you want. I know I want a Hanukkah tree. We've bush. always had a Christmas tree. Uh huh. Since you had to sneak down to your grandmother's house to. Well, we call that a Hanukkah bush. <laughs> it's over, Chef Larry. It's over, John. It's over. <laughs>